Today, and I'm a transgender, queer, psychic, proper shaman. I'm going to talk about how I'm the fate vanity and how I'm the Church of Scientology's new patron saint. So they're getting all my vanity from now on. I like their book. I like how they collect all the prophets, all the shamans, so I already told them Then I was their new patron saint. Who doesn't want the goddess of vanity as a patron saint? I'm also going to talk about some things I've been thinking about since I'm also the goddess of warfare. I was thinking the other day how Area 51 could start blowing up all the countries and then sit there and watch them rebuild and then blow them up again and then how nobody would ever know they were even there So Area 51 could blow up Africa, and then the few people in Africa could start rebuilding. And they would never know Area 51 was ever over here. And then Area 51 could blow up Russia. And then the few survivors would start rebuilding. And it would be uh, weird little huts at first. And then when it and then when it got too big, Area 51 could blow them up again. And watch them rebuild. So as a war strategist type person, I would say that's really dangerous. Area 51 could even blow up America. If they blew up America right now, nobody would know what happened. We'd just be wandering around, trying to find food. And that's the end of today's I'm a transgender queer psychic prophet shaman.